Hey, Collective Hey, welcome back, guys. Welcome back. Shout out to the entire YouTube fam. Whoa, guys. <laughs> um, shout out to everyone that has donated. Thank you. Everyone that has booked a personal reading. Thank you, guys. Um, personal readings are closed until March, okay? So give me some messages for the collective. I'm seeing past life guides, okay? The number seven is here. Somebody could be a path life number seven. Who's a path life number seven? Comment down below, okay? But I'm seeing present assistance, karmic lessons, okay? For somebody there, you, you, I feel like you getting ready to close out. Hold on, guys. Let me try to fix this. I feel like you are closing out a, a karmic season, okay? I'm picking up like rural car energy. There has been a successful completion, okay? You have some type of, again, this say present assistance, okay? You have past life guides. For some of you, these are your ancestors, okay? I'm seeing talent guides, okay? Uh, spirit mentors and teachers, okay? So for some of y'all, these are... um. These are people, these are people connecting with you who, let's just say with that talent guy, right? Let's just say, I'm going to say music. That's common, okay? Uh, you might be into music, okay? So there is someone from a past life, okay? Or someone that has passed over that is assisting you at this time in that area, Yeah, up from depths, releasing difficulty. And look at this, the number seven, and then the number six is here, okay? The, something is on the countdown, okay? Goddess of dreams, something that you've seen, okay? You need to be counting down, okay? For some, for some of y'all, yeah, your hard time's over, Okay, hope, optimism, uh, new beginnings. Your hard times is over. There is some type of justice you finna get. Something is about to balance out in your favor. There is a solution to your problem. This says solution. For some of you, yeah, you have a problem, okay? You have a problem with this releasing difficulty here. Again, I'm, I'm picking up a real car energy uh, there has been some type of successful completion. You have a new beginning. I'm seeing attachment, okay? Wow, with ancestors here. For somebody, your ancestors are connecting with you. You have some type of present assistance from your ancestors. historical connections and purposes for somebody you have a purpose there is a purpose uh that your ancestor is assisting you with for somebody you feel an attachment to one of your ancestors you feel an attachment to one of your ancestors okay I'm seeing a uh, wisdom, inspiration, Akashic records, goddess of dreams. Wow, this is dope. This is dope because we saw goddess of dreams. And this is, is, is coming out with Akashic records for somebody you've seen into the storehouse of information, okay? There is something that you've seen about this new beginning. There's a new beginning that you have. You've seen this. Wow, it split here beneath the surface, hidden truth, something unknown. It's something that you know. You can't see it in the physical realm, but you've seen this in the spiritual realm. Something is hidden beneath the surface. Whatever this is, you are seeing in your dreams. Elementals, okay? Nature spirits is here. 
the four elements. I'm seeing cleansing and atonement here for somebody. You come from a shaman lineage, okay? Your, your shaman ancestors connecting with you. For somebody, you might feel connected to the fairies and the elves, okay? You are connected to animals, okay? You like draw animals. I'm also, it's like people, th listen, <laughs> everybody, this ain't for everybody, but for somebody, somebody from a past life visit you through animals. They visit you out in nature. You see a lot of different animals or you have a lot of different run-ins with animals. This is how they visit you. There is an attachment. Wow, the Ace of Cups is here. Wow, with the World card. What did I say? There has been a successful completion. For somebody, you get in some type of love. For somebody, something... Let, let, let me clarify this. What is this Ace of Cups? Let me clarify with this other tarot. What is this Ace of Cups? Wow, the Ace of Pentacles with the Page of Pentacles wanting to come out, something that you don't see. I'm also seeing the Queen of Pentacles here, a lot of Pentacle energy. energy. Something uh, heavy in the material realm. I'm going to take the Ace of Pentacles, okay? Two Aces, wow, an Ace to clarify an Ace. That's dope. And look, look at this. So y'all know aces are like gifts from God. They are divine gifts, okay? Um, and it's two aces are falling on top of past life guides, okay? It's something heavy spiritual that is taking place around you. Something in the spiritual realm. For somebody, you got love, okay? You, you getting assistance in your love life, okay? For somebody, you also getting assistance like in, in when it comes to your finances. It's something heavy financial or something heavy, again, in the material realm, okay? You might be getting ready to get some property. This might manifest as a new job for some of y'all. This, this has to do with money. So for somebody, your love life and your money is going to be great. This is like a wish fulfillment energy. What is this new beginning? The Ace of Swords. Stop playing. Collective. Look at this. King of Pentacles and the Hermit is here. Wow, new beginning with another ace. We seeing three aces that came out to clarify. What did I say? There is something heavy spiritual that is taking place in your life, okay? This around your love life and again, around your, your root chakra, your stability, your finances, your security, your safety. This is spirit saying that's the truth. <laughs> new beginnings, that's the truth, okay? That's like a yes. I'm also picking up for somebody. You're going to get some type of clarity with this Ace of Swords. Let me do this. What is this Ace of Swords? What is this Ace of Swords with new beginnings? We got one. This is the Ten of Swords. 
but this is everything is fine, okay? Something is not over. There is an ending, but something is not over. Here is your 10, but you got your one. So it ain't like it's the 10 of swords, something ended, okay? Where you might not see the beginning, okay? But your, your one came out before your 10 came out, okay? So for somebody, this is confirmation, okay? There is some type of new beginning that, that, that you're getting ready to start. The 10 is here, but here is your one. Everything is fine, okay? Wow, the Ace of Swords again. Everything is fine. For somebody, you finna move. Two of Wands, you finna move or you finna travel. There may be some type of relocation. What is this wisdom, inspiration, Akashic Records? Wow, and this card is a 10 also. What is this wisdom, inspiration, Akashic Records? What is this the collective is seeing? Oh, let me use my other deck. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm... What is this um, the collective is seeing? I'm seeing the eight of swords. You ain't seeing something. You ain't seeing something for what it is. You definitely finna get some clarity. The eight of swords is here. You not seeing something. You feel stuck or you feel trapped. What is this eight of swords? This is taking me to, so <laughs> this is taking me to, y'all know I have a lot of divine encounters. I have a lot of divine moments. You know what I'm saying? Like my relationship is real personal. You know what I'm saying? So when your relationship, when, when you have a relationship like that, it's like, you don't really have to wait on communication all the time. It kind of, you can have conversations. Like, so there was a conversation. <laughs> there was a conversation that I was having, okay, with God, that I was having with the Holy Spirit, okay? And the Holy, I heard the Holy Spirit say, I've shown you, but you still don't believe, okay? This is what I'm picking up. See, it's something that God has shown you, but you still don't believe. What is this Eight of Swords? The justice card, I've shown you, and you still don't believe, collective. Wow. The justice card is here, and the star card is here also. For somebody, you a star seed. You are very, very spiritual, okay? You are very spiritual. Again, for somebody, it's something that God has shown you that you still don't believe. You finna get some type of justice here. There is some type of justice you finna get around your love life and around your finances, okay? You have past life guides that is assisting you. You have angelic assistance at this time. You are connected, okay? Remember nature elements, nature spirits, okay? Your guides visit you. They be animals. You have animal guides, okay? For somebody, you have animal guides. Wow, this is dope. Um, Yeah, the high priestess. It stopped right here at the high priestess.
All right, let's see what, um, let's get a couple more. We are gonna pull from, um, let's, let's pull some more Oracle just to get some more messages. All right. Collective, I've shown you, <laughs> but you still don't believe. You tapped into the Akashic Records. Give me some more messages for the Collective. These past life guides are helping you overcome the karmic past. You've learned your lesson. For somebody, you've learned your lesson. Look at this. Activation. And we're seeing call to action. Power surge. Earth mission. You've learned your lesson. Lady Venus is here. Light activation. Okay? I, activation is here. There's collective. There has been a shift. I'm telling you. There has been a shift. For somebody, you in your winning season. This is your winning season. That's what I'm hearing. You are in your winning season. For somebody, you are in your winning season. There is a new beginning that you have. Up from depths is here. Okay? That's that karmic past. You've learned your karmic lessons. You overcame that. Once you overcome the lessons... You can be elevated. For somebody, you being elevated. This they call the action. Power surge. Earth mission. You have a big mission here on earth. You, you could be a light worker. You are very psychic, okay? Wow, clairvoyance activated. That's confirmation. You are very psychic. You are very psychic collective. The Lemurians is here. For somebody, you come from a Lemurian lineage, okay? You need to follow your intuition. Pay attention to the things that God is showing you. Pay attention to the things that are being revealed to you. Again, I've shown you, but you still don't believe. Spiritual awakening is here. <laughs> this is dope because this is falling next to clairvoyance activated. You went through some type of awakening collective. It took for you to go through an awakening to for you to reach this point. This spiritual awakening is falling on top of this new beginning. It took for you to go through this awakening collective to get to this beginning. You had to go through something to get something. Yeah, the teacher awakens, okay? For somebody, you a teacher. The student becomes the master. It's something that you've mastered. It's something that you've mastered. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This has allowed you to overcome the karmic past. Learn the karmic lessons and move on and elevate. For somebody, you are very wise, okay? You also have an old soul. You have an old soul. You understand now. This says interconnectedness. Understanding the inner workings. For somebody, you understand now. So God can bless you with something. It's something you finna be blessed with because you understand now. For somebody, you a light worker. This is confirmation, light activation, call to action. You a light worker. I'm also picking up an energy like... With this call to action, yeah, be seen. Let the world know your gifts. 
God can't use you if you don't speak, if you, if you not going to speak up. How can you be a vessel, but you scared to say something? How can you be a vessel, but you scared to go against the grain? You, you being called to action for somebody. Yeah. It's time for you to start speaking. Okay. For somebody, you a teacher. Okay. It's time to be seen. It's like you being called to the forefront with this be seen here. Yeah, God is calling somebody to the forefront or somebody is being brought to the forefront collective. Wow, <laughs> Jesus is here. Acts of service. When you serve, the universe serve you. So, so you, are, you, you like a servant of God. Okay, you a humanitarian. You do a lot for others with this acts of service here. You somebody that put yourself last. So again, something is being reciprocated to you from the universe. There is a blessing that you about, again, the year of karma. Why is 2024 the year of karma? Okay. This is what? Uh, the number eight year. The number eight resembles what? The infinity symbol. I call it the boomerang. You know what I'm saying? Because what you put out, is, is it's going to come back. For somebody, you got something great coming back. Wow, divine knowledge is here. Higher learning. Commit to your vision through study. For somebody, you've mastered your gift. We taught, I said this earlier. You've mastered your gift. You 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 hold some type of divine knowledge, okay? This what this was what that spiritual awakening was about. It had nothing to do with what you had, what you really went through. It was all about you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This is a dope download I'm getting, y'all. When you go through things collective, it, it, it has nothing to do with what we physically go through. Whether it's, um, you know, I'm talking about in the physical realm, whether... You get on hard times and your finance is not right. Whether it's, I don't know, what it, whatever it might be. You know what I'm saying? Some type of trauma you experience as a child or um, I don't know what it could be. Okay, but whatever you, you've had to go through, whatever you've, you've had to endure, it wasn't about that. It was all about that pushing you to an awakening. Something, listen, it's it's almost like um, kundalini rising. It's almost like your kundalini is rising. Sometimes when you go through traumas or you go through experience certain things, you know what I'm saying? It's like it will cause your kundalini to rise. For somebody, yeah, your kundalini, you, you went through kundalini rising. That's what it was about. It was all about your kundalini rising. You going through what you had to go through. You to elevate, okay? This say higher learning. Wow, this is dope, guys. Wow, divine magic, okay? The teacher awakens. The student becomes the master. It came back out. Holy Spirit is being clear. Okay, we channeling tonight, collective. And look what's at the bottom. Sacred vessel with miraculous moment, okay? Sacred vessel is here. You are the answer. Be guided to your purpose. For somebody, God trying to use you. 
or God is about to use you, or you are already being used by God, okay? You are a sacred vessel. For somebody, you supposed to teach. You are a teacher, okay? We saw the high priestess. You are a high priestess or a hierophant energy, okay? You are a spiritual guru. You are a spiritual teacher. You receive information that other people don't receive. Sacred vessel is here. Divine knowledge is here. Jesus is here. It's only one Jesus. But it's like you following his footsteps with acts of service. You, again, you are a sacred vessel, okay? You are the answer. For somebody, you got to teach. You supposed to be teaching, okay? I don't care if it's just doing tarot because sometimes in tarot, you know, we have the ability to teach because like me, sometimes I just share my story with y'all. You know what I'm saying? I just like breaking things down, making y'all, helping you guys understand for those who don't understand what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes you giving me, giving an example will help. So that's why I like giving examples. My examples usually is my experience. You know what I'm saying? And I don't mind sharing that with y'all because I know that my heart is pure. You know what I'm saying? I know I have a pure heart. I know I have pure intentions and I know the relationship that I have with God. I know he has not ever led me wrong you know what i'm saying and it's like if i can share anything with you guys i don't mind because it, you know I, now looking back i understand i'm a teacher i have the ability to teach you know what i'm saying people listen when i speak you know what i'm saying so for somebody people gonna listen when you speak okay people are going to listen when you speak you are a prophetic vessel okay for somebody, you a prophet, okay? Or you a prophetess. Again, a hierophant, a uh, high priestess energy, okay? You have some type of divine magic, okay? That has awakened in you. Wow, this is dope, guys. I'm gonna close out the reading here, okay? Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not subscribed, okay? Thank you guys for watching.